Here comes the NHL rookie, Troy York, near side. And fake shoots! He had five hole, but Kapelmaster blocked it in time. Now it's an opportunity for Wichita Falls to strike on their chance. They're going to go with Jonathan Lazarus. He'll be the first of three shooters for the Wildcats. Connor O'Brien prepares himself, and in comes the right-handed shot. Lazarus looks, looks, forehand, couldn't get it off. Connor O'Brien threw the stick out, and that disrupted Jonathan Lazarus. Never had a chance to shoot it. Great goaltending there by O'Brien. He got the pad out in time. And here's Lundgren. The coaches have talked about his shot so much. Can he give his team the lead in a shootout? The second of three shooters. In comes Lundgren fast, and he's blocked off by the blocker of Kapelmaster. It's still 0-0 zero to zero in the shootout period, second round. And out comes Adam Goodsir looking for goal number three this weekend. One of the youngest skaters in the South Division, and he's a goal scorer. Good serve, fires one wide. Had that low corner marked, couldn't get it, and out comes Peter Kessel. This one to put the team ahead. It's Peter Kessel's shot. Can the native of Michigan put his team on top? Kessel, right side of the zone, pulls back, shoots, and no goal. It goes off the top right corner. That goal should go to the penalty box for the Brahmas. It's not been their best friend this weekend. Kessel almost took the lead. The bar said no. To end this game is Burnett. Him and O'Brien. Burnett shoots one wide. O'Brien taken out, and neither goaltenders allowed one in the first three. We'll go back and forth one apiece until we have a score. The Brahmas have, have needed more than three rounds before. It didn't happen until all the way back in the NHL showcase against Fairbanks. Here's Berardinelli. He's going to come blazing in to take his team in the lead. Shoots one, and Kapomaster knew what he was going for. And that was just excellent scouting on his part. He came out of his net and went spread eagle on the ice to keep the lower pad stopped. Coaches, I think, were trying to call for O'Brien maybe to come off the ice. I don't know why. The entire bench was waving him back. This one to keep it going. Albrecht in, shoots, big save, OB. Man, is he pumped up. Fifth round we go. Jacob Romo hasn't scored as a Brahma. Will this be the first? Jacob Romo will take his time. Kaplmaster out of his net. Romo shoots. Blocker save. And the shootout period rolls on. Nine saves. So far in the shootout, zero goals. Bolio shows Kapelmaster some love. He's going to have a chance to win it. They're 0 for 2 in game-winning shots so far. Can Bolio end it now? Shoots, another save. They keep trying five-hole on O'Brien, but the lanky netminder has good reaction to get down as the six-foot-two goalie saves his fifth of the shootout. Brahmas go for Melberg. He missed the overtime winner yesterday in a controversial call. Can he end it now? Backhander blocked. Melberg stays out. Will anybody score or will this roll on all night long? It just takes one. It goes back to back. If your team could score, it puts the other team up for elimination. Fourth time. Litviak now can end it for his team. O'Brien trying to win it. Litviak in a backhander forehand. And O'Brien stops another. This is fun. The goaltenders are unreal. Walt's fingers are flying with Twitter updates. And Dalton Skelly Hey-o. is the first D-man. Can he end it? His dad Rob watching just to our left up here. He's got his hands folded. Here comes Skelly. 
across the blue line. Looks on Kaplmaster. Skelly backhander. It's robbed by the left pad. Kaplmaster looked behind him. Thought Skelly had him beat. Six shooters for the Brahmas. Nobody could score. Connor O'Brien stopped five of five. Alexi Poikola on the ice now. He has to go six for six in saves to keep this game going. Alexi Poikola will take the puck now. He's going to go left side into the zone. Poikola looks, backhander, it's blocked as well. Acme Brick, got to be the sponsor of this one. He's trying to give Davidson an idea of where to go. And, oh, would this be a textbook ending? And he is riling up this crowd. Davidson loves it. Can he do it against the team that hates him? Davidson blocked by the right toe. Yoga pays off for Kaplmaster. Davidson had him beat seven saves in the shootout for Justin Kaplmaster. Nick Rosa will have a chance to win it. Can he do it for his team? He has one goal this weekend. Rosa in. Rosa's shot blocked by the glove. Both these netminders are humongous in net. Over two, uh, six feet tall, and they are a perfect 14 for 14 combined. It's Joey Fallon's world in the eighth round of our shootout. Can he get the go-ahead goal? Fallon, forehand, scores! Yes, he can! A huge goal for Fallon. Can Connor O'Brien go eight for eight? and win this game in relief. He's got a chance. Are you kidding me? It's Pison. Pison in right circle. Wade shoots, and he scores. Oh, man. He gets in five hole. He actually missed his shot. He screwed it up, his stick handling. But he still had a chance to shoot it, and here comes Tyler Drevich. 1-1 one, in one a shootout, round nine. Drevich in, top of the left circle. Shimmy's forehand is blocked by Kaplmaster. Only two scores and 17 shots. And Jeff Baum, the Colleyville native, in the third year Wildcat, will try to end this game at home in a shootout. One to one, round nine. Here comes Baum. Him and O'Brien. Baum right side. Baum fakes. Big block by OB. He got on the right pad. They've really been trying to go low. Nobody can elevate the puck, and that's been costly. We're in our 10th round. I need some oxygen. Wickline will try to go ahead. Wickline in. Wickline with speed shoots, and he's stopped right to the center pads of Kaplmaster. We're going to run out of shooters here quickly. Michael Rounds will give it a go for Wichita Falls. Jeff Potter may be looking up my eligibility at this rate. Who is going to be the hero? Who wants this one more? Rounds in. Shoots. He goes wide. Doesn't put it on net, but he had that blocker open from Connor O'Brien. And Bud Madej has his name called. Round number 11. The goalies have been 90% with their saves in the shootout. Made in. Made shoots. He's blocked as well. Brahma's now 1 for 11 in their shooters. Now it's a head game. Jake Dalton on the ice for the Wildcats. Can he win it? They've had so many winning shots, and Connor O'Brien has saved every single one of them. Dalton in. Dalton shot. Blocked by O'Brien, the defenseman couldn't do enough there, he didn't know what he wanted to do, I don't blame him because obviously the fake outs aren't working and here's Carson Kelly the California native looking for the second Brahma goal in the shootout period round 12 Kelly into the zone, looks right, shows five hole and it's closed
Now it's for Matt Hines. Don't even know if he scored a goal this season. Native of Minnetonka, Minnesota, defenseman Matt Hines with a chance to win this game again. Hines in, left side, speed, backhander. O'Brien blocked it. It's underneath his pads. He lost his stick in the process, and Hines didn't do enough. And here comes Camp Clark. He won the game in overtime back in before the holiday in December here at the KYC. Can he have a chance in a shootout? Clark will come in on the forehand side, fakes a shot, backhander, scores! He lifted up high and he got top shelf. Brahma's up 2-1 to one in the shootout. This is round number 13. Show him some love. And Rourke Russell will try to keep this game alive for Wichita Falls. Rourke Russell into the zone. Looking glove side, O'Brien lost it and he scores. Wow. <laughs> this is awesome. It bounced off of Connor O'Brien. What round are we in? 14. <laughs> Matt Christian, let's go, buddy. Matt Christian, the score, his NAHL first. Will it be in a shootout? Christian in. Backhander scores! Wow. Matty Christian! 3-2, Brahma's on top. It's Van Wy to keep the game alive. O'Brien stopped almost everything. His team's giving him a chance. He stops this one. The Brahmas win. This is it. It's the centerman for the Wildcats. Van Wy eases in. Forehand. Oh, no. he scores. <laughs> oh, baby, what a game we play. Two times. The shooters oh, for Wichita Falls lost control of the puck and they've scored. <laughs> man. I think, I think this is round 14. I was going to guess 15. It's Brandon Estes. Estes in. Forehand. Oh, no. Couldn't pull the trigger. Really didn't have a shot. Capelmaster went with them the entire way. And now the chance to win for Holden Cronin. This is the 16th round. My apologies. 16. Cronin in. Cronin forehand fakes. He didn't get a shot off either. <laughs> O'Brien stood Sean big. Giles. We're 3-3. Three, three. Here comes Giles. In the 17th round of a shootout. And with Sue Omen's injury to the Brahmas, they're one short now. So it's getting down to the slim pickings. Giles a chance to go ahead. His shot is denied. He tried to go five hole. Capomaster had it the whole way. Another chance for Wichita Falls to win this. Are you kidding me? Gilreath in his own end. Noah Gilreath, the former NA3HL star. Forehand. He is blocked. O'Brien got enough of it to push it away. The tension continues to boil inside the KYC. I think Jeff Potter wants to see if they can go back to another shooter. They went through everyone. Samu Swobnin's up here on press row. You're right. Us. So if that would, if there are 18 Kaz skaters, Kaz That would have been 17. Kaz, put him out there. Tomas, can you go? And it looks like the Brahmas are going to be able to go twice. The team is wearing their helmets backwards on the bench right now. And it's going to be Cam Clark for the second time. Wow. Clark's first attempt, he scored. Can he go two in a row? It's Clark and Kappelmaster. The two going to Ferris State. Can he beat his future teammate? Cam Clark through center. Backhander, it's blocked. Capomaster got him on the high blocker. And the last shooter eligible for Wichita Falls. It's Adam Good, sir. No, no, no. He went already. That You're right. He went second round. O'Brien saying he can't go. 
O'Brien yeah, saying, uh uh-uh, uh, get back tried off. To pull there's, a fast one on him. there's still one more player to go. I'm not even sure who it should be at this point. Taking a look down the lineup card. Let's see if I can nail it on the head for you. He's no, gone. He went. Eric Yeager. Eric. Oh, he's out. But he's out. Jaeger's oh, out. Game he had a game misconduct. Oh, no. What a oh, mess. Oh, oh, man. What a mess. Two in, an injury and a game misconduct. Let's good sir go again to win the game. Good sir scores. Wow. No way. Round 18. And they swarm Justin Kaplmaster.